Joe and Paula White have taken Josh over to the local emergency medical center, where he is on the critical list. Meanwhile, Cindy White and her boyfriend Lance are alone in the White's apartment. Lance is trying to get it on with Cindy. Lance, come on, put it away. That's gross. Oh, come on, Cindy, before your father gets back. That's what I mean, Lance. My brother may be dead. The maggots are everywhere. I don't know if I should. Well, well, look at it this way, Cindy. If this is the end of civilization, then we should make the most of it, right? And if it isn't the end of civilization, then, well, it doesn't matter. So we should do it anyway. Oh. <laughs> Cindy sees the logic in Lance's oh. argument, and they begin oh, to oh, get it on there. on the family oh, couch. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Meanwhile, Valerie is in Bruce's bedroom, fooling with the TV, finally making her selection. Valerie steps backwards a few steps towards the bed, her attention still fixed on the tube. Still looking forward, she reaches behind her and pulls down the covers. She does not see what we see. The bed is crawling with maggots. These are the large, not worst sized maggots. Their bodies glisten with a mucus-like slime. Several fall out of the bed and onto the floor. Valerie continues to step backward in her bare feet. She steps directly on one of the maggots. <coughs> its bloody insides spew all over the carpet. And in a split-second reflex, Valerie jumps backwards, landing rear first onto the bed. She lands right on top of the squirming maggots. The more she tries to get up, the more she slips on the slimy, wet creatures. They are all over her body. 